Hello everyone. Thank you for joining Remote Sensing and JS question and answer session series. In today's question, we'll see how we can able to extract the pixel value of the raster image. So we are going to use QGIS and ArcGIS to do this task. So here, if you'll see, I have an image, this image containing a, containing a rainfall data. If you'll go to the CHRS data portal, how to download the rainfall from CHRS data portal, you can able to download the rainfall. You can visit our channel because Gadamode, where you will get, there are so many videos, you will get this video, download the rainfall data from CHRS data portal. So I have already downloaded this rainfall data and I'm interested to extract the pixel value. If I'll take this identity tool and I will check. So every pixel has a some value. Okay. So every pixel has a some value. If I'll right click and I can color this, I can classify this image. Okay. So let, I will check. So this red area is having a highest rainfall. Okay. This portion. So I'm interested to extract the pixel value for all the, all this image. Okay. So how we can able to extract. So for that, we can able to go to arc toolbox. Okay. Then there is a tool conversion tool. Okay. In the conversion, there is a from raster. Okay. We'll convert this image from raster to point data. After that, just add this image. Where you want to save your output location, you can provide your output location file here. And I will go by default and just click on OK. So here it is. We have got the pixel value for each raster image. So if right click open attribute table, you will see we get a pixel value. We got a pixel value. So if I'll select it, you will see here. So what is the pixel value at that place? So every pixel we convert into point and we get the pixel value for that. We get the pixel value there. So how we can able to do this task in QGIS. So the same process, you need to go to QGIS. Just you need to add layer. You need to add your raster layer. So I have save here. In the folder, I will just click this TIFF file, add, close. So just go to this processing tool, search here, raster to point. So you will see this raster pixel to point. So this image is already added here. Okay. Then where you want to save this file, you can select the folder. I will go by default and I will just click on the run. And so it is finished. I will close it. So now you will see this way we can able to extract the pixel value. So just see the open attribute table. You will see what we have selected. So here we have selected and we get the pixel value and we get the rainfall of that place. So what you can able to do now you can convert a high resolution image from it also. So how we can able to do this means suppose you want to prepare a rainfall data from this point. So what you can able to do, you just need to uh, do IDW here. Okay. So you can able to go to, um, there is special analysis tool, interpolation IDW. Okay. Here you need to provide your image extent and first you need to provide this input point. Okay. You provide the input point. After that, you select here grid code. You select here grid code. And after that, you provide output location. You can change your pixel value as well. And from here, you need to go to environment. And you need to provide extent to it, what extent you want. Just click on OK. I'm not providing extent here. So I'll just convert to this IDW to me. I will just convert this rainfall point data to raster image. Okay. So now if you'll see, I have created an rainfall image from here. So this way you can able to convert this previous resolution image is not good. But after that, when you will convert to point data, you can convert this into 
little bit good resolution means you can able to interpret image very easily here so if you'll see here this portion there is a higher rainfall and again if i'll right click go to properties here i will go to five classes then select this color ramp and you will see there we are able to see this pixel value so similar way you can able to convert you can get the pixel value for each raster image and if you want to export this to excel sheet you can also export to excel sheet from here so export data so you need to provide output location where you want to save this file so just go there and uh, you need to select a folder suppose i am working in d drive okay and here i will save rainfall data then i will provide here that is d base table and i will save it here okay and okay so now i will open my excel sheet so just go to file then browse so here is the path where we have saved the file we just need to select here dbase table okay so you will see this export output dbase file just open it and you will see we have added that point data or what are the attribute data into excel sheet so this way very easily you can prepare and you can get the pixel value for each raster so if you have any doubt you can ask me in the comment sections